Last time on Babs Bear Talk. I did four. Only four? Five. I did five out of how much? Thirteen? I packed five out of thirteen. So we have how much left? Babs. Babs. Wake up, wake up. I just look at your uh, YouTube stuff and you got 170 likes. Uh -huh. I'm, at, I'm at 200. Huh? I'm over 200. And you got 200, uh, 270. 270? 270. I was 269 last night. Wow. So how much are I from the one that's in second? One more vote. She's still at 271? Yep. <laughs> Maybe they can't find nobody else to cheat for them, huh? Mm -mm. <laughs> well, like how you wake up now, it's time where you get up and get me some breakfast. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to Leah's church today. Okay. You want to go with me? Not really. You haven't been in a while, though. Mm -hmm. Not really. <coughs> I was thinking of making some powder bun and take over there. Uh, you can do that. Thank, thank the people who voted for, for me from there already. Mm -hmm. I have more votes to get from there, you know. Mm -hmm. Campaigning is hard. You heard, but <laughs> you reap the sweet. You sure be so end. ugly, Joe. Yeah. Huh? Why? Look at all the. You, these the, are all my comfort things. This is the way you look when you wake up or when, when, when you are. Uh, when Joe has a TV on, I do this. <laughs> <laughs> look at me. When I wake up, I look the same. When I. Because you, you black. <laughs> <laughs> I light bright. I look ugly when I wake up. Hey. Well, I still sleep on my buckwheat pillow though. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. I'm gonna come for my breakfast. Just make me anything you want. Alright. You I want fry fish and jelly cake. Ooh, we have fish? Yeah. We have fish? Yeah, I got a piece <gasps> of salmon out there. Okay, so where do I have to make jelly cake so you could get the fish? No, nah, we got bun that I, I Oh, fire. okay, we have yeah. Okay. Okay, baby. I'll be right alone. there. Hey guys. It is just 7 o'clock. Joe woke me way too soon. And I don't even have to make no Johnny Cakes for him because we have bun. So, when is this fish going to happen though? It's Thaina. I've been doing a bunch of fruit days. Which means just eat fruit all day till like 3 o'clock and then I eat food. Um, not like that lady, uh, Free Little Banana Girl, if you guys watch her. I watch her every now and again and she looks really good but... I would be so scared to do all those fruits all day. Do you guys see much grapes she eats in one setting? Like the big box that I get at Costco, the bin like that, she eats like three of that. And then it's like 30 bananas she blends and drinks in the morning. Like, that can't be good. But then she looks good. I don't know. I don't know. But I've been, I've been watching. I've been drinking her Datorade. I've been doing the dates with water and just drink the Datorade. And that's been, that's been so good. But I'm going to test my sugar. I'm gonna test starting to I'm gonna start to test my sugar later on today after I go through a whole day of just well I don't go through the whole day I, I mix you know a tall glass and I drink a third a third a third you know throughout the day anyways so he has the nerve to tell me don't let nobody kidnap me come protect me if you don't want me to get kidnapped <laughs> you guys know that Leah's in walking distance and um, I haven't been in a while but I'm going today because I really want to go say thank you to all the people who have voted for me in this contest. They didn't have to do it and they took the time to do it.
Yeah. Oh, she does? Oh, okay, okay. That's why she does. Okay, yeah. Why not? 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 Why all right guys so i went to church this morning you guys saw me joe didn't go and the church was so crowded i don't know what happened i think it's because it's 9 11 a lot of people were feeling like they needed god or spirituality or something and so we went to church they sang a lot of patriotic songs because you know leah she fly by the seat of her pants look at this though this is called sugar plum when joe was a kid growing up in oh. belize is the phone right there check to see who it is joe the phone right there somewhere check to see brother who it is. i haven't seen you all day the phone is ringing <laughs> the phone is ringing right there what's the air code it's called sugar plum it's a candy right when joe was growing up in belize his mom would go from sand hill to belize city which is a 17 mile you know trip but you know, back in them days, it was all day. And she would say, Mommy, when you go to Belize, can you bring me sugar plum? <laughs> and this is what his mom would bring him. So my mom brought him some one time. And just, to, you know, to remind him, your here's your sugar plum. What's that sweet of grandma, though? I had a grandma moment a second ago uh -huh. because one of them, a thousand kids in county, is getting married. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. And like... Okay. Uh -huh, and like she breaking all the rules uh -huh. like she hugging her fiance already she kissing him already and they do not like it and I was like god damn it where's grandma <laughs> like, uh. so we're at what now Jada 280? Yeah, 280 280 I'm only seven away from the one that was in second place though so I'm not taking this for granted we're heading into work a little bit late because of me I was just like putting things together trying to get some bills paid that's like the most stressful part of my Monday mornings but I don't do it on the weekends because I don't open bills on Friday. I don't open bills on Saturday and I don't open bills on Sunday. Just my rule to make me have a beautiful weekend. But on Monday, my heart's tight. It's like, oh, what's do now? So I was paying some bills and then now we're heading over to Kaiser because um, Joe needs to drop off his um, colon cancer screening kit thing. Um, it's a fancy way of saying the P-O-O-P. I think that's one of the words I can't say on YouTube anymore and put money on it. And then I don't want to miss out on this little 39 cents I want to make from this vlog. <laughs> I'm teasing, but I'm 50 now and they already put the order in. Because with Kaiser, you could go on the computer and take care of your health that way, right? So they already put the, the thing in the back office saying hey you have to order your colorectal cancer screening testing which you know we're teasing and laughing about this but you guys need to do that okay if you're above 50 you need to do it because if you can do this simple test then you don't have to do like the big test which is the um what do you call the thing Joe? colonoscopy yeah I, I call it a pure you know what with a rubber hose <laughs> You don't have to do that because that's dangerous and painful and there's been debate on that too if you should do that or not so um yeah we're gonna do that the doctor has ordered a blood test for me to check for my potassium because she thinks i'm taking the water pills that she prescribed for me but you guys know that i only take the water pill when i have fluid retention from getting msg but she doesn't know that but i kept filling the prescription because I don't want them to like take the prescription away and then I have to go back in the bag for it when I need it. So it's free. So I have like three bottles on my desk that I haven't taken. <laughs> I'm sure that they're expired. But I'm not worried about my potassium because I haven't been taking them. I think I take a water pill maybe twice a month. Does that does that have to be right like right near me? <laughs> now smell it. <laughs> no! <laughs> it's all wrapped up in a whole bunch of napkins and plastic and you know and then it's in this in this envelope and Joe keeps saying you want to spill I'm like ah don't touch me don't touch me <laughs> it's a daub it's a daub <laughs> that's, what, that's what I'll name this blog it's only a daub <laughs> spell daub d-a-u-b yeah I think that's how you spell it is that how you spell it d-a-b dab Dob? D -A -B I'm gonna have to look that up. I don't let any words get away Dob. from me. If I'm not sure how to spell a word or what a word means, I look that sucker up. I'm not one of these people that has to like say a new word a day. That gets tedious. But if I hear a word, I'm like, wait a minute. I, I hear that word. I heard it before. I don't really know what. What is this on? 
Why does Joe have the radio on? I am. Um, yeah, I, I don't have to, you know, learn a new word a day, but if I hear a word and I don't know what it means even in a sentence and stuff and I don't know how it's spelled in any language, in Spanish or English or whatever language, I'll go look it up. I'll go look it up. Like, I know how to spell weird words like rendezvous. Why do I know that? Because I hear it different in my brain. I hear rendezvous. R-E-N-D-E-Z-V-O-U-S. I hear it different. <laughs> literally just had to drop that off um, I didn't do my blood test I didn't do my blood test because they were on number 21 and I would have gotten number 36 so that would have taken a good 20 minutes so what I'll do is um, order my kit for the cancer screening and then when I bring my kit back that's when I'll stay there and do the blood test I really hadn't planned it out today when Joe says, I'm going to do my test because they called me and they're like, we sent you the kit, but you didn't respond, yada, yada. This is like the third time you're doing it, right? Second. No, you did it You did it twice already, boo. Yeah. yeah. You, he never has any issues. That's why he doesn't... Stop, stop, stop. He never has any issues. That's why he doesn't remember that he did it. Thank God. We always get good cancer screenings. So that, you know, when you get to be our age... That's such a blessing. I mean, at any age, it's a blessing. But when you get older and you do these screenings and they come out normal, it's like, thank you, God, you can breathe again. Joe, why do I hear your door's open, honey? I heard the air come in. He didn't hear it, but then I saw the light on. So I'm going to pop into Walmart right now because I have to buy a pair of scissors because I'm going to be doing a DIY for the Wednesday show. I already did the food. It was fun. We did a competition. I think Joe's product came out as as good as mine. I think mine had a little bit better, um, what, mine wasn't as coarse as yours, right? Mine wasn't as coarse, but I saw what Joe did wrong. Joe didn't get his um, dough wet enough. We, we did something with dough, huh? I never get it as wet as yours. Yeah, yeah, but you know what? We had fun, Joe was funny. Um, Everybody keeps telling me to stop saying if, if I win that show. Leave it on my glasses. They, they keep saying, say when, when I win the show. And I don't want to be cocky because I don't know that I'm going to win it. I know that I'm going to, I know that I'm going to die trying. <laughs> so, um, first of all, let's go over the numbers. I'm at 282. And what I'm going to do today is call all of mom's friends. And uh, they're not some of them don't even have email addresses but they're willing they want to give me their name their birthday and their phone numbers to put in so I'll make them a gmail account just for this contest and I'll put in their pertinent information and I'll even type what they want me to say and I'll let their votes count because they want to help so I have four of them that I'm gonna to call today and then um, who else was like, oh, I'm going to get mom, Leah's mom, because she says if Leah doesn't fill out for the email and stuff for her, you know, for us to do it, she gave us the birthday, everything already. And I'm going to get my dad, because my dad's like, I'll do it before it ends. Why is he like this? Why? Why is my father like this, guys? He knows that I need the votes. He, he knows he's going to vote, because I'll disown him. He knows. And, <laughs> and then he's like, I'll do it before it ends. Oh, he has till Friday to do it because I don't know if it ends Saturday or if it ends Sunday because I think this morning it said seven days left and if you count today as day one Saturday only brings us to six days so I think it ends Sunday night at 1159 
Yes, we bought grout. If we didn't buy grout, you told me we had grout. We said the white was fine. Let's see what the kids are doing right now. I meant you Wednesday. <laughs> it's a nice cool day today. It's only 72 degrees. I wish Wednesday was in Spain. No. Oh God, this smells good though. Jada's making southwestern egg rolls. She's so good at this that I don't even want to learn it. Puts chilies to shame. <laughs> she does put chilies to shame. Cooks fresh. And tonight Colin has his drum off. Oh, yeah. I'm excited about it though. He practiced hard. He's gonna pull a Phil Collins in the middle, did he tell you? At the end. At the end? He goes, do, 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 do. I'm telling you, if, if Joshua and Daddy's here selling that car, me and you are going. We can't disappoint him. Yeah, I told him. him. I told him. <clears throat> we can't disappoint him. He'll, he'll feel bad. And he has Soka in there. He has uh, reggae. Can we record it? Yeah. Ooh, let me go pull off these splits off my camera and put my camera to charge. All right, so my stove is out because Joe's doing a project there. There. I feel like the stove's never gonna get put back. <laughs> Five weeks later, it's still not back. <coughs> we took everything out of the skillet. Tell sure all the grapes are gone. Did you buy mommy some grapes? And bananas. And bananas? I didn't even get one banana. Damn. <laughs> Jory. Jory's like a little monkey. I had a snag one before he took them off. Jory should buy back the bananas he chose. Oh my god. Jada, you're so good at this thing. I love you. <laughs> sometimes this, sometimes the kids are scared when I tell them I love them because it usually means, can you do this for me? <laughs> Did you do that for me? It works the same way too for us. Yeah. So we're at 293. My dad was number 289. Can you believe him? He waited to be number 289 and then call and go, I was 289. I finally voted. No, he's sending out email blasts to all his friends. I'm like, people, for real. I told him I was going to disown him, and I was serious. <laughs> sweet life. Sweet life the sweet life, is that when the girl said, I'm, I'm cereal? Yeah. Huh? I'm cereal. I'm really cereal. <laughs> I don't watch that show. It was old. Like my Who said it? The white girl or the Asian girl? Asian girl. The Asian girl. I'm cereal, okay? I know, I know, I know like, the show, but I don't watch it. I don't watch the show. Mm-mm-mm. Like, <laughs> Yeah, this is at the side already okay, this this recipe, but I think Jada sneaks and does stuff behind my back. No, no, but I think she does stuff. Get out of here. <laughs> don't look at my secrets. <laughs> Are you seeing over this side? I know where that side is. <laughs> you guys, I couldn't stop laughing because there was this lady at the gas station. Her <laughs> gas tank is on the left and she pulled in on the right spot first and then she backed up and went on the other side. <laughs> and then Jada's like, <laughs> She looks kind of stupid because she doesn't know what side her gas tank is on. And she goes, wait till she figures it out. The lady gets out the car and then she looks at us. And she she busts out, I don't know, like a like a like a mad kind of laugh. <laughs> and then Jada says, don't laugh, don't laugh, don't laugh. And I couldn't stop. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just like an old man. I think I told you that's where you get it from. That's exactly where you get that old man laugh. It was from. like when you were in church you when you were small and laugh. your mom's gonna pull your ears because you're not supposed you to laugh in church and that's when you get an attack of the giggles. It was like that. I wasn't really laughing at the lady, but I was laughing at Jada. Oh, Jada was like, wait till she figures it out though. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it was too funny. So we're heading down to Guitar Center in what? Rancho Cucamonga, right, Jada? Never seen yeah. a guitar center. And um, Colin's in a drum off. It comes once a year. I think he only did it one time last year. Oh, it's like it was his first time. And it was two years ago. Jada, how long ago since Colin did the drum off? Does he go back? Did he go back since that one time? No. Oh, he's never gone back. Okay, I'm sorry. My bad, guys. He did it in high school, <coughs> like the last year of high school. Well, because it's, it's, it's in a span, so if he gets through this round, he has another round to do. Okay, so yeah. does he have to go through, like, eliminations to get to this round? No, this no. is no? the no? first round. This Anybody is the initial. Yeah. So why did he not come back to this round? Huh? Talking Remember when he did it the first time? This Why is, did, they didn't, they didn't this take is, him. This is like the, the first time again. <clears throat> yeah. It's with this. Okay, so the first time mm -hmm. he did it, that was the first one. Mm -hmm. and he didn't make it. They picked those, what, right, three guys? Right, he didn't guys. make it. Uh huh. Yeah. And so those three guys moved to the next level. And Wakong was out. Okay. And then I think they. So did this one is the more. first time it came back around mm -hmm. again then? Yeah. Oh, so it's not that they have it every year? I don't know. 
Well, we don't know. I think, it, I think it well, they didn't every year. He just didn't do it after. Yeah, he, he was mad when they didn't pick him the last time, and they cheated him. They did. They cheated yeah. him. You know, not because Colin is like one of my kids or whatever. Because if they're bad, I'm gonna tell you they're bad. But Colin's a true. brilliant drummer, and they cheated that little boy, and he was PO'd, man. And um, <clears throat> I'm like, I'm really praying for him to win this one. I'm gonna see if I can record it. He's got all kind of tricks that he's going to do. Joshua's going to tell you. Let me make sure I see you. Joshua's going to tell you why they cheated Colin the last time. They cheated that boy because he's white. Exactly. Right <laughs> exactly. He was the only güero yep. in only the competition. White only white boy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So this is one um, incident when white privilege did not work. Yeah. <laughs> That's he, true. He, he deserved it though. He needed to be more ethnic. <laughs> Testants are going to move on to the store finals, which will be held in two weeks. One winner from the store finals moves on to the district. One winner from district moves on to the semifinals. And pardon me while I multitask, but I'm the only one here tonight to be doing this, so. <laughs> Each contestant gets five minutes to set up the kit. You only used about half of that, that's cool. You're gonna get three minutes to rock. He's gonna get a tap on the shoulder at... What do you want? 20 seconds, 30 seconds? Let's get that 30 second tap. He's gonna get a tap on the shoulder at 30 seconds in case you see me walk in there. It's not me telling him he did something wrong, that's me telling him he's gotta wrap it up. He's got three minutes to rock. Tell you a little bit about him. Hails all the way from Fontana, California. <laughs> He's been drumming for eight years. Influences like Benny Greb, Mike Johnson, Johnston. Let me get that T in there, Johnston. That's right. Great clinician instructor. Three minutes on the clock. The clock starts on the downbeat. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Colin. Yeah. yeah.
Well done, sir. Well done. Hey guys, it's Wednesday, September the 14th. I'm heading into work right now. We don't have any work yet because we're still waiting for bottles to come for my large order that I do. Well, I used to do it three times a year, but now the guy is buying more when he buys, so I'm doing it two times a year. So I'm still doing the same amount, but in two increments instead of three. I'm thinking I might go to the Noonday Bible study today. Um, I'm a lot encouraged right now after talking with Joria and Joe, but I was very discouraged this morning because when I saw them announce that they picked 18 uh, semifinalists for the contest that I'm in, I'm like, well, maybe I'm not one of the 18 because I haven't received any correspondence from them. And I'm assuming that they have to correspond with you to tell you you're a semifinalist. But Joe's like, maybe no, they're just going because they don't, they don't fly you in or nothing. They just show your video. So they don't have to tell you. You can see it the day and they want to make sure you're watching. So I'm going to believe that and be encouraged that I'm one of the 18. They have 15 more to show over the next five days. So tomorrow, Thursday, they'll show three. Friday, they'll show three. And then Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Jory thinks I'm in it and I'll be shown like on Monday. So I hope you guys are watching the show to see. And if you see my video pop up at the start of the show and you've already seen it on the East Coast, you call me. Calandra, you call me. And anybody on the East Coast call me and say, I saw your video pop up. So I'm really hoping I'm a semifinalist because if I'm a semifinalist, then I can get some exposure by my video being shown on the show. And then that gives me the opportunity to possibly get chosen that day to be a finalist and then to actually go there. That would be awesome to actually go there, even if I don't end up winning to go there. You guys certainly did everything you could do to help me. I don't even know that the likes in round two really matters because we're have, we have like six days left in round two, according to the Dream Jobbing website. And they've already chosen 18 semifinalists. So do we really have six days left in round two? You know, I'm just doing math right here. And then the next thing that I wonder um, is, did they pick the 18 off of when we ended round one? Because then I was coming in third. And are they really picking off of the likes? Because the two people that they showed, well, they showed three today. One of them had 213 likes. She actually came in sixth when round one was over. And she's actually a seasoned pro. She's already doing this on the East Coast. Um, she's a, a food contributor to all the major networks on the East Coast. And then the next two was this one guy that I love dearly. I even gave him a like. And George's like, why are you voting for your competition? I'm like, but I like him. So he had five likes and they showed his video and I was happy for him. And then the next lady, she had one like. I hadn't even noticed her submission, to be, uh, to, to be quite honest. And um, she got some exposure too. So I'm happy for all of them. I'm not the, the envious type. I'm happy for all of them. But are they really picking you based on the likes? Because if that were true, then there are a lot of other people who has 80 likes and 124 likes and stuff like that that didn't get chosen in the mix today. So I'm just going to wait. I'm not going to be on pins and needles. I already prayed about it, gave it up, and I'm going to be at peace. And I'm recording the show every day just to make sure. And if I see myself, I will rush back and tell you guys. If I don't see myself, oh well, we'll know by next Wednesday if I was a semifinalist or not. And then that will really tell us if they were picking based on the likes, right? So that's what's going on. Yeah, so let me head on into work. When the red button is on? Yeah. Okay. Okay, guys, see, I'm doing it. Go back on the boat. Splash. Splash? Yeah. 